Right. If you like what you see, why don't you think about subscribing? And make sure to check out my channel for videos just like this. All right, just a quick heads up before this video gets started. This is only gonna be a simple tour of my actual roomette on the train on Amtrak. This isn't gonna be my full review or this isn't gonna be one of my solo documentaries like I usually do. Those are coming up soon, hopefully in the next couple of weeks. But right now I just wanna put this quick video out so you all can see it. I hope you enjoy it. Peace out. All right, people, so it's your boy, Mr. Bucketlist. I'm about to do a tour of my roomette. I'm so excited right now. It's a lot more spacious than I thought it was gonna be, so let's check it out. All right. Like I said, it's so dope. Got my bed up there. This is a bed down here too. Pretty cool. YouTube. Okay, so first, as you all can see, this is the seat. So I have my bags and stuff here. I'll tell you, there's actually a lot more space than I thought it was going to be. I'll show you all of that in a bit. But for right now, I just have my bags down here. And then right here, you have your sets of lights. So you can turn on, like, for example, the lights up here. And then you have your wall light. Sorry if I blinded you there. And then a little reading light. So you have your options of lights. And then um, as far as AC and all that stuff, so this controls the lights up top again, as you all can see, keep that off right now. AC unit, you control it all this and that. You got your attendant button, so if you want to ask them for a drink or something like that, just press that button, they'll come around. Um, you got more fans and stuff like that. And then you got some little cubbies up here. Um, so if you want to hold some stuff or whatever, that's fine. And then you have your privacy curtains. So I'm not going to have them close right now so you all can see what's going on. It's getting dark here. Um, your privacy curtains. Now, like I said, you got storage up here. So I actually have a fairly, so it's about a 24 inch bag. Um, it fits in there. It's pretty loaded. And I got my little backpack. And as you all can see, there's still more room. So you got that. And then, folding sink. So you got your folding sink here. It's got water use or whatever it goes right down to that little hole so pretty cool um, and then of course it's got a light little light to tell you hey the sink's down the mirror lights on and off and turn that on and off pull it out of service and plus the toilet and you plug so all that's down there it says ice water I'm not sure if I'm gonna try to drink it or not but it's there you got cups soap I mean literally everything that you need and then again you got the same thing on this side but this time you got speaker volume so that's pretty cool you got all this Got your seat. So this is my comfortable seat. I'll sit down and show you all the room here. So I'm sitting down. Now I'm not that tall of a guy. I'm about 5'11", but plenty of room for me to chill. Once I move my bags and stuff, I can put my legs up. So that's pretty cool. And then you got your menu, which I'll go over in a bit. Not right now, but your menu to see what I can order for tonight. And then another little valve for you to turn it on and off the air. So if you don't want the air to shut it off, you want the air open it up cup holders, table, all this and that. All right, so some things I missed here. You do have a toilet here. I was about to use it, then I realized, I'm like, wait a minute, the curtain's open, like, it's a lady right beside me, that'd be kind of weird, so I gotta make sure to shut that when I do use it. You got a little trash can. A lot of people didn't mention that in the videos I did watch. You got a little trash can, and then I guess that's toilet paper. So, I mean, all that's there for you if you're sitting down. Oh, for example, this is me sitting down. I can just reach forward and grab the toilet paper if I need to. All right, so now going up to the top here. So you do have a bed up here. For you to bring it down, you have to push this hook like this to the side. And then bang, you got a bed. So it's got windows, it's got mattresses, it's got everything you need. So pretty much, I don't know if I'm going to sleep up here. I don't really see it. I'm not a fan of bunk beds and stuff like that. I never was as a kid, but as you can see, it's got little windows. So I mean, easy to get some nice, just some nice views. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, oh, these blankets are pretty thick. Oh, so this is the 
Perfect from you all. Wow. do is give you all a full kind of view of how much space you actually have in these things so I'm gonna go ahead and sit down so this is it I mean it's pretty it's pretty stacked not bad at all um, now a lot of people in their videos they try to do all these awkward camera movements and stuff like that and that's what I get for talking job Alright, so like I was just saying, a lot of people like to do like awkward camera movements and stuff as far as they just don't get the whole picture in here. So this is me. Um, like I said, I'm about 5'11". Um, enough space in here. I mean, if I put my arms this way, I can't. But if I do it lengthways, I actually can without just another side. So like I said, it's... Let's try again. So I got my bed made up floor. Got my TV down here. The amazing race. Got this cool night view so I can look at the window while I'm laying down and watch the TV. It's so cool. Alright, so my bed is officially made up. I am chilling. It's actually not bad, so it feels like a, a twin size bed but either way I mean it's more than enough room for me on a train got people in coach sitting in seats not bad at all no I can't see anything out there so I don't know what's going on but got the amazing race down there got my pillows I hope you all enjoyed this video like I said this is just gonna be a short tour of my roommate and some portions of the train itself I hope you all look forward to my actual documentary of my solo travel through Amtrak and through NC. It's going to be a really good video. I'm going to spend a good amount of time on it. And again, I hope if you all are new to this channel, check out my other videos. Subscribe for more. I'll see you soon. It's your boy, Mr. Bucketlist. Peace out. Just about to go to bed.